This is Houston. Say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part 8 of the Elder Scrolls Online on the Xbox Series X, the High Isle Collector's Edition, no less people. And we are exactly where we were at the end of the last part, we've just investigated the lighthouse, and stood standing right below it. And uh, we've got to go and get this idol, the lighthouse idol, to relight the lighthouse. Let's crack on. A, we will use our steed, but I'm going to have a little bit of a run first. The... Idol seems to, yeah, retrieve the lighthouse idol seems to be up that's away. And then the second part, or the next part, will be investigate the shallows, which is up the other way. Let's see what we've got for a few fights there. Look at that all jumping out the water over there. <laughs> Mahusive fish. Probably eat me if I go swimming out there. Certainly making a bloody racket. Fight. Wow, that went well. Pellets of High Isle. Blimey. That's an early drop. Foul hide. The Epaulets of High Isle. Well, they come up as green. Uh, let's see what they're like. And hope that guy doesn't attack us. No, no, hang on. Shoulders, isn't it? Yeah, well, they're better... Magicka recovery and stamina recovery, but less health. Uh, sorry, less spell resistance. Quite a lot of spell and physical resistance down the way as well. Good 500. Yeah, the bonus isn't really worth it. Nice, quite quite liking that new move we got, which is on my RB button. I forget the name of it, but <laughs> it sort of peppers them with uh, arrows, I think. Yeah, it does. Sends out a whole bunch of arrows at the same time. Hitting, hitting both of them at once, look. Oh, your little badger has got all his health back. You think I'd learn me lesson, people? Lesser Sea Adder went down in one hit. Well, what are we in for here? A bunch of raiders, methinks. Oh, yeah, badger. A bit of ginger, sure, why not? Takes some whole inventory slot, that ginger. The feck. Well, be rude not to pepper them with arrows, I suppose. We could sneak away around it, right enough. 
But where's the fun in that, eh? It's a bow off. I won. Where the fuck he came back from? Just killed you a minute ago, mate. Precious metal. Ochre harvester. I mean, I just went in guns blazing. I suppose I could have spoken to them. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't quite work out that way, though, did it? Ow. This vanishing one's doing me nothing. Thank you. The Idol of Kinnereth. Or is it the Idol of Billy? Nice day for a white wedding. Retrieve the lighthouse idol. Lovely. Examine the orders. Take a band of recruits to the Ganfallon light Head Lighthouse and remove the Kinnereth idol. The Lord wants the light extinguished to deny Kinnereth's guidance to certain ships arriving soon. Do not damage the idol or harm the keeper unless you have no other choice. We do not want that. Oh, hello. I knew that was going to happen. The bloody respawn too quickly. Uh, poison much? Yeah, it looks like they've just come back, doesn't it? Well, we might as well have a little look a bit while we're here. Investigate the lands. I think we've been up this way, though, didn't we? I think it was one of the first things I did was kind of wander off. Yeah, because I remember the ditch over here. Something glowing up there, though. Look, red, red glow. Rune stone. Nice. Rakuta. Achievement unlocked. Epic acquirer. Oko. Mundane rune harvester. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I love being a little bit mundane, you know. certainly worth uh, wandering the land a little bit, isn't it? Get certain pickups. How ye do, farmer?
Oh, it's a spriggan. Can we fight on horseback or no? There, uh, that'll be a no. The minute I hit the fight action buttons, just the horse vanishes. Or the steed, if you want to call it that. Oh, hello. Uh, the fuck? Oh, bloody hell. She's got herself a bear. We all know how well it goes with bears in games. So Blimey. Try that again. Mundane, Oko and Tar. Oh, Tar very much. Hmm, don't think I meant to go up there. I'm figuring these runes are going to be hidden around big rocks, going by the pattern of those two that I just found. There's another one. Seriously, Steve? What the fuck? Haku and Tar? I still haven't found a use for these runes as yet. I'm assuming they sock it into weapons and such like. Looks interesting. Okay, we'll go down there in a second. So a quick look up here. Oh, hello. He's a big badger. Stuff's over there as well. We bridge. Mm, ships over in the water there as well. Something gloweth here though. How do I get off my horse? <laughs> Without doing a big move. That'll do. Sky Shard. Nice. Pieces collected, one of three. So I wonder what you get for a set. So each area must have a set of Sky Shards then. I feel like they were on the map, the old Sky Shard symbols.
Uh, feel like I'm in a fight. Oh, Jesus Christ. I've walked into enemy area. Right, dude, seriously. But he's flipping all over the shop. Fracking frack. That's enough out of you, flipping egg fire. Well, there's a few of them kicking around, isn't there? He just he's just the one that spotted me, I think. Yeah, there's another one there. Holy fuck. <laughs> that went a bit uh, in a direction I wasn't expecting. Uh, you discovered a group dungeon. It is best to adventure in these areas with a group. Group dungeons are private, so only other group members can enter with you. Alright, okay. Sneaky. Decorative wax. Yeah, not much of use around these parts. Hear something growling. Oh, it's a dog there. Look. Oh, fucking okay, hell, there's a few of them. We've gone way off path here, haven't we, really? But it's what adventuring's all about, I suppose. We didn't go back to that place we were going to investigate, though. We'll definitely do that. Although... Uh, <clears throat> city bit up there. Castle Navia Way Shrine. Spooky, spooky floaters over there, people. For want of a better phrase. Check that out. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, it's a, another player. Castle Nevere Catacombs. Hmm. Oh, hello, who are you? Well, we could go and check the catacombs out, I suppose, but it wasn't part of the initial plan. Oh, well, maybe not. Can't actually open them. Must be part of a quest, maybe. Might as well get the way shrine while we're here. I heard the daughter is so distraught, she's refusing to leave her rooms. So exciting. Scandalous. No doubt Isabel is beside herself. Poor girls. Well, we've discovered it, so we can get back here any times we like. Nice, 122 experience for getting Castle Nevada discovered. Now, I do think it's a good idea not to go in there at the moment. <laughs> because I've already got a million things to do. We'll come back to it. It's just fantastic, isn't it? What a game it is. Right, I'm going to go back all the way. I'm going to investigate that little... If I can find my way back to the beach, I'll investigate that little cubby hole in the beach. And then we're going to go back with the idol. Carry on with this of Knights and Knaves quest. I heard the daughter is so distraught, she's refusing to leave her rooms. So exciting. Scandalous. No doubt it. It's quite cool the horse has its own stamina, so if you do have to leap off and start fighting, you've not wasted your own stamina. Quite like that. <clears throat> you go up that way. Nairn route I just walked past somewhere. I'm sure those are the ones that used to make that humming noise already. Yeah, because we went behind this big fiery guy, didn't we? We fought one of them up in the other area, I'm sure. Should we fight another one? So we get on. Yeah, Volkesh Young definitely fought one. Well, I'll take your heavy sack as you don't need it. Ooh, 10 rough maple. Thank you very much. That's very kind of you. Jewel. 
giant clam. I wonder, you know, just want to check out the... Hey. There we go. Just try this one out for a bit, maybe. Here we are. This is what I thought looked slightly interesting. There's probably nothing in here now that I've just come all the way back for it. How cool is this? Beautiful. I'm going to have to, have to take a picture in here, people. Who lives in this place? Oh, it's another player. <laughs> Just fishing. Early Brews Cottage. I might be trespassing in here. Visitors! Oh, yes, oh, yes. A delightful change of pace. <laughs> well, he's very excited. Early Brew. Is it time for an early brew? Well, goodbye is the only option I have there. Yeah, I feel like this is maybe part of a quest that I've not triggered yet. Okay, let's get back with this. Uh, let's get back with this idol. Nice day for a white wedding. Do 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 do. Well, there's a big bear. It's <laughs> scratching its back on the rock, though. That's brilliant. Love that. I am assuming that I am heading to the lighthouse. Yeah, I am. Oh, it's a fire up there in their parts, people. That's not a good sign, is it? Oh, it's a little volcano bit. Big battle going on over there. Nice. Oh, steady. Oh, 
well though, I'm getting a bit uh, oh I'm getting a bit singed here. Bloody hell fire. Can't seem to figure out how to take my potions. Overly sure what the purpose of what's happening is, but anyway, seems to be getting. Uh, oh, I'm going to die. <laughs> oh dear. Fucking hell, what the hell was that? Christ, I'm not doing any damage to that big fella. Bloody hellfire. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> Apart from getting tanked, completely tanked. And dying again. There's a massive health bar at the top right now. Christ almighty, can't move for this bloody stuff falling from the sky. How do I use these bloody things, people? Fucking hell, that was a bit harsh. So I'm using up an awful lot of bloody soul gems to get this fight done. Nice. Great work. The questions still remain. 
I shall return to my order and report all that has happened. Until we meet again. Oh, hello. Got a big pile of stash here, didn't we? Bloody hellfire. Wow. I feel like I've, uh, it's obviously a group of folks that are playing together. And there's just me by my sad old self. <laughs> <laughs> Joined in with their fight and reap the rewards. Hey, well, we did all right out of it, though. Materials. We're picking them as we go. Not overly sure what the cool yellow thing was that I picked up. Oh, there we go. Anthology of abodes available for acquisition. A large sheet, uh, a large sheaf of papers detailing properties in there, in and around Tamriel. Uh used to add to your law library hall of the lunar champion discovered i have detailed herein the general location and value of the most of most of the homes and rooms for sale in tamriel to seek out property without such a guide is a firm misstep but fear not for i have done the heavy lifting for you the thrifty one can purchase a modest uh, in room these were recently put on the market and many serve as a quality starter home. Alright, okay. Bloody hell, it's a fair old document. Right, meanwhile, back in Gotham. Hey. Now let's investigate the shallows. Who are these badges? Sir Colinian Murard. I had to draw that map because you left the road to chase a fictional dragon. It's not my fault we're lost. What's this? Are you distracted by my glory? Do you not recognize the hero standing in front of you? My deeds may be humble, but my name lives on in song. Believe me. And now my squire and I are on our way to give the bards <clears throat> more to sing about. Did your squire say that you're lost? A minor setback, I assure you. We were going to stop a horde of bandits and elevate our names. But then a travelling druid told me about a dragon, and I confess my excitement got the better of me. No matter. We'll find some great villainy soon. What sort of villainy are you hoping to find? Your squire seems upset. She's angry with me. She feels that I failed to collect rations for this journey. Rations? Who needs food when adventures lie ahead? Her skills are commendable, but she still has much to learn. Which is why she is the squire and I am the knight. What sort of villainy are you hoping to find? Does it matter? Evil must be defeated wherever it is found. Otherwise it festers like a... like a... festering thing. My squire would have a good metaphor. If you're looking to rob us, we only have crumbs. My Nightmaster was supposed to keep track of our supplies, but I think his vanity is rotting his brain. Ugh, I just need to find him some sort of adventure so we can go back and triumph. Why do you need to find him an adventure? He won't do anything to help people. We've let three villages suffer because their problems weren't grandiose enough. I'm half tempted to invent some great villain just so he'll find the motivation to fight. Well, I heard there was an evil knight blocking the roads into town to the south. I'm sure there's a dastardly pirate ship terrorizing the west coast. There's an enormous trove of treasure lying somewhere up north. 
A evil knight blocking the roads. An evil knight, you say? Huh. You know, that just might be odd enough to work. My knight master will probably spend the entire trip challenging the other knights we meet along the road, but what else is new? I'll tell him about this villain right away. You're welcome. Lena Erard. Well, Fare ye well. Do you know where we're going now? Lead on, I'll follow. Nope. <laughs> I thought we were going to move, but they're not. Oh, I've lost me bearings, people. Where's my lighthouse gone? Return to the lighthouse. It's up here. Actually, you know, the one thing we haven't tried is our uh, standard horse. I don't think we've actually tried our standard mount, have we? Have we got any of the others? Uh, Battlefield Nightmare Sench. Seem to have. A Crypt Warden Deathhound. A Sench Rat. And an Aminus an Ornog. <laughs> nice. It's kind of a smaller animal, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, not quite as keen on those, but anyway. I think we shall return to our normal horse. Equines, I think. Give our normal horse a run out, I think. You return, and with the idol, place it here, and I shall call forth its light. Mother Kinnereth, this traveler has set right the desecration of this holy place. Return to us your blessing, and let your light shine over the land and sea. <clears throat> Marvellous. I cannot thank you enough. With the idol returned and the light restored, we can ensure the safe passage of many a weary traveller. Is there any way a priest of humble means could repay you? A blessing, perhaps. Three ships never arrived in Ganfallon Bay. Did you see anything from up here? Hmm... Shortly after the lighthouse was pillaged, I spied three ships on the horizon. Then suddenly, the clouds darkened, and a terrible storm began to blow in. I lost sight of the ships after that. Perhaps they were simply blown off course? Is that sort of weather common here? Aminos is notorious for its storms, but Kinnereth generally blesses High Isle with fair weather. I wonder, the way the storm swept in seemed unnatural. And it happened so soon after Kinnereth's idol was removed. Do you think that's why the knights attacked the lighthouse? The idol has little value outside the lighthouse. Its light does not shine in any other location. My order believes Kinnereth's light blesses High Isle. Why steal the idol unless the knights meant to revoke her protection? A troubling thought indeed. Fare ye well. Right, investigate the shallows is next. I'm expecting a mighty experience bonus after this quest, people, I'm hoping. <laughs> For all the running around I'm having to do. Hey! There's our normal horse. 
Well, it does seem to be gerade aus for das investigate das, das shallows. It's a little bit of a shame it's not crossplay on the game, isn't it? You think for a game this size and magnitude, they would have done a bit of crossplay for it, but. Yeah. Not that it matters a great deal for me playing on my own in this playthrough, but. Could have in theory played it with friends and stuff offline. Some of which might be on Xbox and some might be on PlayStation. Well that looks... It looks a bit ominous but I think it's just a home. Well, we're running out of path, people. Where the bloody hell are the shallows then? They're over there. Looks like, doesn't it? Need to go over the bridge. Blooming big bridge at that. <laughs> Love how the sound of the hooves changes from wood to stone. My spot. Find your own spot. What are you looking for? Anything shiny. Look, this is the best spot. Albert used to have this spot, and now he's a knight. I bet he's eating meat pies and berry tarts right now. All I need to do is find something they want. The, uh, what, who wants? The knights. They wear helms and carry no emblems, but their armor is knight armor. They asked Albert if he wanted to go with them. He's a knight now, too. Just need to find something they'll like. Something to show them I'm worthy. Well, good luck with that. Ah. Augret Oni. Oni. I'm going to go with that. What you saying? You don't look like a salvager. Come to join up with those so-called knights who've been hanging around, did you? Bah, I'd rather go hungry than swear myself to the likes of them. Three ships. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Three ships never arrived in Ganfallon Bay. Have you seen anything? Haven't seen anything sail by in the lock recently, and no new wreckage washed up today. But I've been keeping my head down. Those robber knights have been chasing off salvagers who won't promise to help them. Tell me about these robber knights. They were recruiting, or at least offering the chance to earn a reward. They wanted people ready to haul in whatever came ashore. Several salvagers went with them. I wouldn't, though. What I find is mine. 
Where did the knights take the other salvages? To a cave just down the beach. But I'd avoid it if I were you. Old Charbel nearly lost his head snooping around there. I don't know if they found what they were looking for, but I think they left a few nights behind to watch the shallows. Thank you very much. Fare you well. There's one. Khajiit. They're getting quite a few gold drops now, aren't they? Iron Helm and Petty Glyph of Health. Seems to go back out again. Yeah, it's a lot of iron kit is given me at the moment, which we won't be using. I do find it a bit annoying that I can't climb ladders, but anyway. Knight Odris's orders. Well, it would help if I could type people. Within the next few days, several ships will be damaged on the approach to a high isle. We expect wreckage to wash up in Loch Abane or along the northeastern shore of High Isle or the southeastern shore of Amenos. Capture any survivors from these ships and bring them to me. Muster all reliable recruits and make sure they are in place when the survivors wash ashore. Chase off any salvages who refuse to assist us. Your new recruits may hesitate to lay hands on shipwrecked survivors. Remind them the reward is a place in the Ascendant Order. As knights of the people, they will never go hungry again. The Ascendant Magus. Talk to Lady Arabelle DeVoe. Oh, hello. I've got to fight them all again now. <laughs> they don't, don't have to come back quick, do they?
Well, we can go the quiet way out, I suppose. I think we need to go across the river. Steady. What the hell are they doing? Well, I'm pretty sure about 20 hours ago, I started this quest with a <laughs> Arabella DeVoe. Pretty sure we can actually teleport back here, but anyway. Nice day for a ride. Hmm. Feel like she's actually outside now, if that's the case. Seem very close. Yeah, there she is. Good. You found my field office. I thought I'd keep an eye on the lock while awaiting your report. My own investigations have turned up little about our missing ships. Tell me, did you uncover anything useful? Did the lighthouse keeper spot them? Well, I do have news as it happens. After Rogue Knights darkened the beacon, the Keeper spotted three ships before the storm rolled in. Darkened the beacon? The locals revere that light. Who would dare offend Kinrith in such a way? Something is indeed wrong here. At least our missing ships reach these waters, but this storm worries me. Tell me more about the Rogue Knights. They're known as the Ascendant Order. The inn's patrons said they attacked caravans inland. The Ascendant Order? Here? <clears throat> I heard rumours of knights troubling folk outside of town, but I had no idea they were the culprits. I've had dealings with the Order before. This doesn't bode well. Tell me, did you learn anything at the Shallows? Someone called the Ascendant Magus recruited salvages to capture shipwrecked survivors. It seems the Ascendant Order knew the ships would be wrecked, and they helped make sure by extinguishing the lighthouse beacon. They knew my cargo was coming to High Isle. This means the Fighters Guild and Majors Guild delegates are in danger too. Uh, wait. What does your missing cargo have to do with the delegates? Ah, you caught that, did you? My missing cargo is more delegates for the conference. Perhaps the most important ones. But I need you to check on the guild delegates right now. They went to visit a druid named Ravana. Her hut lies to the west. A Ravana, is it?
You know the Ascendant Order. What else can you tell me about them? The Ascendant Order models itself after other knightly orders, but they're nothing but terrorists. They claim to stand against those who would subjugate the nations of Tamriel under Imperial rule, but I suspect they plan to take power for themselves. Are they a serious threat? They are well funded and have a strong presence on the mainland. They proclaim a powerful message about greedy rulers and costly wars, but it's mostly rhetoric. Not that the common folk see that. Our conference makes a tempting target, I'm sure. Tell me about the Guild of Representatives. Valesia of the Major's Guild is a dear friend. We shared a few adventures when she was starting out, and I called upon her when I needed help with the conference. She enchanted the invitation medallions the delegates require to attend the conference. And what about the Fighters Guild delegate? I only met Guild General Quentin when he arrived. He seems to have a good head on his shoulders, but the war has cost him dearly. He lost his wife in a raid. I understand why the Fighters Guild chose to send him to the conference. Who is this druid the Guild representatives went to visit? Her name is Ravana. She's something of a local apothecary. She uses her skill with herbs and healing to help the folk of High Isle. With the conference delayed, Valesia was curious about druidic magic, so off she went. Quentin decided to tag along. Fare you well. Well, that didn't give us any XP, did it? Or have we... Not that I noticed, anyway. We're creeping towards 14. Ense Frandar Hunding Deck has been updated with Geomancer's Ense Deck Fragment Collectible. A. Still seem to have. Oh, don't, yeah, new daily reward. First seed rewards, March. A hundred crown lethal poison. Picked up quite a lot of stuff here, which I still don't know what to do with, but could visit the bank, of course, and dump it. Still got 40, 40 sockets free, though, so... What? Why is it still saying I've got unread stuffs? Oh, it must be inside each element, mustn't it? Yeah, we could do with visiting a shop, really. Well, the Druid's Hut is that away. Oh, there's another shard, look. I'm assuming that's what they are. I've only found one of them. Under the middle bridge spanning Loch Aban. that away. I wonder if we should ride towards that actually in the next part. Time are we on? Hey. It just doesn't feel like it's that far away, does it? Oh, there it's there.
So there's another sky shard kicking around these parts somewhere, but where it is is another story. It's one of those things, maybe it pops up on the map when you get close enough to it, it will display itself. I mean, if you look at that map, actually, we've not discovered an awful lot of what's here yet. <laughs> I thought, it's one of those, though, I feel like I just want to pop in, go to the shop, dump a bunch of stuff, and then crack on, but I'll probably walk into this place and not remember where everything is. Well, that's supposedly a store of some description. Baskets and bags, is it? Don't mind the rumbling. We get that around here occasionally. Now, what are you looking for today? What do you know about the tremors? That's Mount Firesong. It's a restless sleeper. Snoring, belching, twisting, and turning constantly. And High Isle shivers every time it does. I don't see a mountain. You can't. Not from Gonfalon Bay. Mount Firesong is on Iphelon, the island to the northwest. But its roots run all through the sisters. Iphelon's bad dreams can rattle windows and shake shelves here. All the way over here on High Isle. Well, we can get rid of the bits of armor that we don't want. Still not sure what uh, glyphs are. Glyphs seem to be very major orientated, if I remember rightly. Iron gauntlets can go. Iron helm can go. We'll keep all the other material bits. In fact, they can probably go as well. Oh, I can't sell that. Battle Axe of the Green Pact collected. <laughs> what? I'm meant to be selling stuff. Pewter Ring. Increases maximum stamina by 6767. Actually, I think I might have sold a pair of gloves there. I hadn't checked out. Never mind. Kulan weighs will. That was something we got for doing a quest, wasn't it? Increases weapon enchantment effect by 15% and reduces enchantment cooldown effect by 50%. Well, I think that'll do it. I think the rest of the stuff I need to check and... Yeah, stamina goes up and health comes down. Magicka recovery goes up. Not by much, though. Uh, well, a couple of hundred. Yeah. Maximum Magicka goes up a fair bit, though. I'm wondering if the... Well, I don't know, actually, because the health... I have been losing health in the big battles, so it might be worth keeping those on. I don't know how well I'd sleep if I... <laughs> I don't know why I can't sell these items. What 
was that all about? So I couldn't sell that one either, but... I'm confused. I'm not sure why I can sell some and not others. Oh, it's the backpack person. Don't be the explorer. Can't afford an increase, yeah, that's fair enough. That's just another way into the inn, isn't it, I think? Wow, well, that is a big soul gem, isn't it? Hey, can we remember where the bank is from here? I think it might be out here. Maybe this one. Or is that the inn I was just in? That's the same shop, isn't it? I'm sure there was a, the bank was facing out this way, though. Yeah, that's the backpack woman. Yeah, we're back in the end now. I definitely stumbled on the bank around the same time. Yeah, that's the end. Hmm. Ah, here we go. Big chest on the door. The cautious coffer. I took this job to see what people want. Yeah, the bank capacity is not great either, is it? I wonder how we increase that. Bank space is a thousand gold. Increase your bank size to 10 more slots. Christ's sake, it takes up a, a full slot just for every piece of bloody vegetation you pick up. Still not sure about the the trash. Sell to merchant for gold just seems to say, doesn't it? So you could just get rid. See, move, move to trash would be good for some of the weapony stuff. That would be well handy. Back to 18 of 90. Right, well, I think that's cleared us up for the next part, people. I think um, we might as well continue the Knights of Knaves quest and head to the Druid's Hut. Yep, it's over that way. Well, there you are, folks. Thoroughly enjoyed that once again. 
We shall crack on with that quest in the next part. It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you once again in the Elder Scrolls Online High Isle edition. And I shall catch you in the next one, folks. Take it easy. Bye.